Chris Diamonds, shining bright. Buying Medivia coins, we do it right. Crypto picks, options in sight. Curse Diamonds, elevate your height. All right, numbers are growing here. We're about to start, guys. Uh, Dillahunt's going to be taking us through some some of his rare collection, just some of them, not all, because he doesn't want to spoil too much for the events coming up soon uh, on the 18th, I think. So that is in about like two weeks. So he's going to have his yearly. I don't think he had it last year, but he's going to have his yearly uh, rare events on next 18th. A lot of giveaways He's going to be giving, I think, a Thunder Hammer. He already there he he already um revealed that giveaway some mc some chilled backpacks and some stuff so that that will be pretty cool how do you redeem redeem the scrolls so um you gotta stream there's a um, you you need to do a stream with the medivia online tag on twitch and then you're gonna receive automatically the streamer role in discord and then once you have enough stats for to claim the, the the scroll, you just need to ping Shuna or create a ticket on Discord saying, "Hey, I already have everything I need for my um, you know for my monthly premium scroll." But of course, you need like uh, there are some rules that you have to follow, so you know so a little bit tricky. But I can link you a link later that explains everything. All right, suppose we can kick off. Not sure, Dillahan's back, yeah? Um, yeah, I'm back. So. Great stuff. And I'm recording this, by the way, guys. It's going to be available on the okay. box. Yeah. So, um... Uh, if... Uh, geez, once, uh, one one yeah. thing. If... Uh, I'm going to tell the people on the stream that they can't... Then, I'm not sure if it's okay or not. They can't ask stuff. Yeah. So, okay, what do you think about it? Sure. I mean, uh, let, okay. I, I'm on your Twitch as well, just in case. If I see any questions um, popping up there, I can maybe take a look and um and and uh, ask myself directly to you through here is that okay but let me post the All discord right. link anywhere so people can uh bring some numbers yeah. bring more people here i think saffron's probably coming soon anyway and probably tagging a shit ton of people as he normally do to try to raise more yeah. awareness but anyway we'll see how it goes so uh let me just start by thanking you for your time Dolan. um i mean you know, it, you were the at least one of the few rare collectors in Medivia that I know. Um, I don't know many anyway, but I think you're one of the few. And the collection that you have is quite impressive. Some items there I have no idea even exist. So that's pretty impressive. And I, I think you're going to be taking us through a little bit of those. Um, just so you guys understand how this is going to work. So I'm going to be asking Delahan a couple of questions about his rare collections, about himself. If you guys have any questions, just post on his Twitch stream or here on Discord as well. I'm going to be monitoring both. And then we can um, uh, ask him directly if you guys have any questions uh, that he didn't cover very well or, or anything of those sorts. And just to let you know as well, this has been, um, I got a, a very nice gift from our friends at Curse Diamonds. They are allowing me to do a giveaway of 300 Medivia coins. So it's going to be three separate giveaways of 100 MC each. So the way this is going to work, it's going to be through comments, um, uh, like sort of like a giveaway on the comment section on the YouTube VOD that I'm going to be posting this VOD later. So you just got to go to the VODs, comments, uh, 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 I think it's hashtag Curse Diamonds, and then I'm going to be doing a giveaway, um, three prizes of 100 MC. It's going to be randomly selected out of the comments. And then you gotta, you guys going to be able to um, um, get that prize. Yeah, so it's three prizes of 100 MC each. So that's pretty nice. And I think, Dolahan, you also want to take this opportunity to tell about your giveaway that you're doing, the premium scroll. Yeah, uh, after the interview, if you go by my stream, it's already, you can already see it there. You can type exclamation point uh, ticket and you participate on the Premium Scroll giveaway. I'm going to do it right after the, the, the interview ends. 
and uh your 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 giveaway chief it's the gonna be a youtube right your youtube yeah. stuff or doing yeah. the or doing the the event no the, the, it's okay. gonna be on youtube i'm gonna probably leave uh, after i post the vods of this session here i'm gonna give about a week or two and then i'm gonna do the, the the drawing i can maybe do the drawing by the day you know on the 18th on the day of the event so we have everything happening on the same day so that's a possibility yeah um yeah so I'll, I'll give people like about two weeks to comments hashtag curse diamonds and then we do the random giveaway uh, uh three prizes of 100 mc all right so yeah, i posted right. here on discord as well how people can go to your twitch right after and just do the hashtag um exclamation okay. mark tickets and by the way when you do the 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 the, the prize draw or whatever the person needs to be online and say hello back right i think that's how you do it yeah yeah on okay. the stream on the stream yeah Absolutely. okay yeah yeah that. okay also the another giveaway that will be happening uh i already i think i already, already revealed like two giveaways let me pause it here on the cha channel so I'm not sure if everyone everyone knows or not, but during my hair exposition event, there will be three giveaways that I'll be doing. At each two hours, I will make one giveaway. The first giveaway will be the chill backpack, the Bull Unsane Tapestry, 100 MCs, and a mystery box. The second giveaway will be the Thunder Hammer. And the third giveaway will be revealed also at the end of the stream. So, I Thunder hope you Hummer. got <laughs> how, how many Thunder yeah, Hammers pretty... are there? Like, it's quite rare, right? It's impressively rare. Yeah. Like, it's now they don't say it's considered like very rare, but not extremely rare. Yeah. Depends on the server as well. Like, if you take by Destiny and Legacy, like, the the one, one, one X loot lock, yeah, loot rate, I think, is probably like, way more rare. Mm -hmm. but, but same for Ornate Helmet, but on high hate, uh, that's not like, not super rare. Yeah. Like, you can find like a couple. It's not insanely rare. All right. And uh, you're going to be announcing the third giveaway right after this, yeah. right? Is that right? Okay. Good. Yeah. Anyone want to try to guess which, uh, which item that I'm going to be doing the giveaway, the third giveaway? See Let's if see we have if someone can guess, right? Yeah. So it's only one item, is that right? Or is uh, like the a, third giveaway? Yeah, the third giveaway. Yeah, it's only only one item. It's gonna be one item, okay. And one. can you give a tip yeah. if it's like a, a decoration or like a, a weapon? Uh, let me try to think about it. Yeah. But don't give a, a very big hint. Anyway. Yeah. Just, just yeah. Like, Let's say it's. It's an item that's very desirable by people. Let's say that. Very desirable. Yeah, it's very desirable by people. Like, can be an ornate helmet, can be like, I don't know, can be larvae legs. Okay. I don't know, maybe. How, how many, like, <laughs> is that, is, is it an item that exists, like, one in every server, apart from the new ones, or it's like more rare than that? uh you can see it, it's not it's not like a unique item okay but it's considered like very hair mm, okay. like extremely hair nowadays i see okay let's see. well let's see if anyone pops up the question you're not going to review anyway until the until yeah, not right now. yeah okay oh. good stuff so let's see if we keep having gas guests coming um there's a question for bardo rude um how much is a thunder hammer worth would you know? uh depend yeah depends on the server pretty much but like the, this one that i'm doing the giveaway i paid 2k mc Holy 2000 shit. mcs for this one 2k so yeah 2k mc a lot of mcs yeah okay um yeah wow. for yeah I, I bought it i bought it clean yeah like three months like three or like three months ago someone like a level uh a level eight sold to me so eight, okay. uh, yeah probably like you can see a lot of items like this 
on on live OAs because people don't like to reveal themselves. Yeah. You know, so that makes, that makes a lot of sense. So it drops from OBR yeah. Thor. Okay. Interesting. All right. Yeah. Uh, a lot now on, on Legacy or Destiny, I think you could probably find like for a couple more, like maybe three to, to four KMC. Oh, shit. Yeah. You know, it pretty much depends. Yeah. On how much you want to pay and how much the guy wants to sell. Yeah. All That's right. Pretty much it. Okay. Thanks for answering that. So I think we, we got out of our introduction here. Uh, guys, please keep the questions coming. Um, so again, thank you for your time. So we're going to be having those two giveaways, one in the YouTube VODs and one in Twitch, and also the item review, the third giveaway review uh, for the events on next 18th. So I'm just going to start with a question uh, to get to know a little bit more about you, Dulahan. And by the way, do you like to go by Dulahan? Do you have a, like, do people call you something else, like your name, or or you like to go no, by Dulahan? Yeah, it's usually Dulahan, maybe Dula. like a short, like Dula. Dula. Like okay. people show days to tough. Yeah, you can, yeah. You can call me either one, and, that's okay. And like, for, for, like where the name comes from? Uh, actually, it's from the game called Castlevania, like Symphony okay. of the Night. Yeah, that is a that is a monster there that's called Dullahan, mm -hmm. but I think it's with M. Let me try Dullahan Castle Castlevania. I think it's this guy here. Okay. Oh, you're posting there. I mean, yeah, I'm posting the the link. Yeah, that's where it comes from. Let's see, Castlevania fandom. Oh wow, it's the guy with the. Oh. Yeah, I'm not much into Castlevania, but interesting there. Oh, is is that the guy with the Durahan? It's probably a Japanese yeah. name anyway. Okay. Castlevania was like one of my favorite games. Yeah. Okay, there's a guy there. Can it I call you like... Brightwing? I'm not sure where that's from. <laughs> but it's probably... Yeah, that's that's an old character he had. Oh, in Castlevania. There's that old character he had. No, oh, no, no, Bright, no, in, in right? Even. Oh, okay. Yeah, I made it. I had a Carter. I think it was one of my first ones. Mm. It's actually, I think. Let me see. I think one of the pictures that I was going to sh that I'm going to share with you guys. Yeah, it's actually like with that Carter. Yeah. So, By the way, you can share and, your screen, or you can just keep posting pictures in the chat. That also uh, works. Whatever you prefer. Uh, I had her just post screens on the on the chat. I think it's better for me. Okay. Okay. Great. You see, this that uh, Brightwing was one of my first characters on novels because I used to be a novels stayer a long time ago, before I went to Maine. So you can see like a very old picture, and I had the house scroll and the premium house scroll on okay. novels. So that's like one of my oldest pictures that I can that I got to to bring back. But uh, I sold it, that card already, so I don't have it anymore. Okay. Because not and a lot those... of people realize, right? But houses, you used to have, like, scrolls for the VIP houses and the, the normal houses, right? I, I had no clue. Like, they didn't have the website auction. Was that the case? Yeah, like, for, no, they had, but for premium houses, like, for VIP, yeah. uh, you had to, to buy with those scrolls, you know? Mm. Like sometimes you had to give like one house scroll and one premium house scroll to buy a house. Oh. You know, sometimes two premium house scrolls, you know, sometimes two house scrolls. Yeah. But those scrolls you know, were like deleted like I don't know, like five years ago. Yeah. I, uh, I think with the, the show, with the introduction to Medivia coins. Because oh. the premium well, yeah. way before the premium used to be bought by Yellow Rose. Yeah, like a yeah. premium yellow rose. Mm -hmm. So it didn't have Medica coins. But I think after they introduced the Medica coins, they Yeah. And they started to to change this. Interesting. Huh. And then how how like before Medivia coins, like how how did it work? Like you would go into a website and like you pay with PayPal and then you receive the items on your depot by the system automatically, like a scrolls? Yeah, I think the 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 yellow the yellow rolls, as I remember, the yellow rolls used to, re to receive it, it. Like I think on your depot. Yeah. Can't remember that very well, but I still have like one picture of me. Like I already posted that on the general channel. Like mm -hmm. I'm buying wasn't even Medivia by then. It was Chibanik, the yeah. mm -hmm. old the old name. So I even have this like this one of the 
my old pictures there with these framing yellow rose. Yeah. It doesn't exist anymore because I think all they became the the premium scroll. I'm not sure. Okay. No, interesting, interesting. And uh, just like a little bit more about you now. Like uh, you said, we can call you Dulahan or Dula Greets. Like uh, yeah. you're from Brazil, of course. Is it Sao Paulo or somewhere else? No, I'm from, I'm so Carioca from Rio de Janeiro. You don't have the accent somehow. Okay. Um, or a very, very light Carioca accent. Mm -hmm. And um, you, what do you do in real life? You sometimes you post some photos of like you in uniform, like is it the army or like the Navy? Yeah, it's the Navy. I like last year I was studying a lot and I made my, I made exam to like a very hard exam to get in the navies. Oh. And I I was accepted. Oh great. And now great. right now I'm like I'm gonna complete one year in next month actually. Okay. I I also get graduated, graduated no, I promoted to first tenant. Not sure. I think it's yeah. another name in English. If I'm not if no, I'm first wrong, I think, is, I think we, we have that as well. Like but yeah. congratulations, I, I, that's that's pretty nice. It's definitely not yeah, right now after this, uh, I'm also working with teaching because before I did this, this that exam, yeah, I I was teaching. Like okay. I even have like I even have YouTube and Instagram like professional, but I can't use that anymore since I'm on Navy, oh, and okay. I have like I have to be a hundred percent available on Navy, so yeah. I can't be like I can have like another income profession yeah. you know yeah so, and so, yeah. How, how much of your like since you're in the navy and i have no clue because i i don't know anyone in like the army or navy but like how much time out of the whole year do you spend in the actual sea or in a boat because i think that's mostly what oh navy no is. or that's yeah no uh, uh actually no uh i'm not working on the boat Okay. Uh, my my fiance went to there for like three months, mm. like last year, because she did like another exam. Okay. Uh, different that I took, but I'm an engineer, so mm. I'm just working as an engineer on the navy. That's okay. It. So I just like sit on the on the office, like developing antennas, yeah, like radar radar stuff, like stuff that i can't really talk about <laughs> yeah no it. no of course and uh that's pretty cool so uh whenever people are watching those submarine movies people with the radars and like the little dots so what you do has something to do with that then that's pretty cool yeah yeah developing like those kind of stuff awesome uh okay great to know and uh you mentioned something didn't you post that you were gonna be in poland like sometime soon because of your work yeah yeah, actually, I'm going to uh, on my on my vacation on mm -hmm. September. I'm going to Europe with my fiance. I'm going to I think Netherlands, yeah, then Germany and some other 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 countries. Like I think go, might go to Praga. I think that's Czech Republic. Some uh, like the east the uh, east yeah. side of Europe. I'm yeah. going to, but that's just for vacation. Oh, but okay. I think at the end of the year that it would be like. Uh, greater event and then i'm going to be there for in poland mm. for this event are you planning to visit uh comet soft if they <laughs> i don't even know if they have like a, an office that people can walk in i don't think so uh, i don't think so either yeah. but if saffron if saffron or shuna or eldry i doubt i doubt that eldry want but saffron yeah. and shuna uh, i think we might get a beer yeah i don't know is Shuna, is Shuna also in Poland? Because I thought he was Dutch, but or maybe I'm wrong. Uh, I'm not. I'm not. Actually, I'm not sure. I thought he was American, so oh, that's wow. like out of right now. So no one knows anything about him. Great. Okay. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> yeah. No. Awesome. And uh, okay. So let's let's jump on to the next question, though. So, okay. what what made you start becoming a rare item collection collector in this case, okay. like like how did you start like you mentioned it was from tibianic that's where you started right you know, actually i started way back then in tibia like okay. i think it was 2004. Mm. let me see if i have like a screen to to share with you guys here i think 
I think that was like one of the one of the most memory memory like days of my my Chimbe career. Mm. Like the uh, there was the test server that everybody knows about. The that we had like the German test server and the American test server on Chimbe that people loved to kill each other and whatever. Mm -hmm. Uh, and sometimes the GMs and the, the gods, they used to give like uh, free uh, free items, like free hair items, like the demo legs that used to be like extremely unique way back then. And I was happening to be talking to one of the gods. Let me see if I have this picture here. I was happening to be like just chatting with one of the gods and... I don't think I have it like ready here to to share. Let's see. And I was talking to like one of them. Gods from what? official Tibia. You're talking about like the gems yeah. and the, okay. Yeah, I was talking to one of the gods and just chatting with him on the Germany test server. And then during my talk, I don't know, he decided to give me a demo legs. Oh. And by then the demo legs didn't like was was extremely hair already already. Like you couldn't you couldn't like you know, you remember the old demo helmet quest that used to be the 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 demo legs, and they they deleted it and made the demo demo helmet. So by then, the demo legs was already like unique. It was like extremely hair, and he gave me one of those. I was like, oh my god, really cool! And then I decided to like start my own co start like a collection of repairs yeah. on test server. I remember oh. I still I was still like three days, it's like two to three days, uh, like a week, just collecting those those items. Let me see if I can share like some screen okay. here. And and that's all on test server. Like the the items didn't get carried yeah. to the official. No, team, no, I'm in test server. Yeah, yeah. You can see the pictures there. Like you can see there is like the great axe, great shield. Like all that was like buying, like trading and buying doing the the test server. Uh huh. Griffin shield, Gondi boost, Thunder Hammer, Magic Long Sword. So after that, I start just to oh my god, like, okay, there's a like something really cool. So yeah. I just got passionate about it. I also have like one with let's see, uh, the Gondi helmet here. They are the golden helmet as well, the winged oh, wow. helmet. And that uh, out on test server. And where would you like go to collect those items, or you just like ask the gods for those items? Or no, the god, no, the god just gave me demo legs. Okay. And then I just, yeah, I just started to trade and loot mm -hmm. also from people because they used to be like wars on test server. Yeah. So people used to like kill each other and drop stuff. So I just got lucky, got lucky and like bought, bought some stuff, you know? Okay. And how would you, like, you would buy with the actual money within the game? Or would you like do a... No, no. By then, I was like 14 or 13 yeah. years old. So I don't like, like, I had low, no income at all. So yeah. that was like, I could buy anything on the game. I remember asking my mom, to buy my first premium account was like mm -hmm. something like already insane to do. Yeah. So it wasn't like uh, put, uh, pay to win purchases. Okay. No, I also had like like in Brazil, like not not sure if everyone here realized like to buy a premium account in Tibia for a Brazilian, you would have to know someone with an international credit cards back then anyway. Yeah. And like it was extremely rare that anyone would have an international credit card, um, and only like the you know wealthy people, I suppose. So it, it's quite difficult. It was quite difficult anyway to to get a hold of a premium accounts back then. So what's this next picture here? Oh, I see the Windows XP yeah, going this, on there. Okay, Windows XP. Yeah, this like. I want, I always like loved Rook Guard and these mysteries around it, like the Sword of Fury, mm -hmm. and like I always loved Rook Guard. That's why when I started on on Medivia, I was a novice player, mm -hmm. and I played there with Pendulum with a couple of friends, and you can see there even on Chibia, I also like it to collect like some some hairs. Oh, even on novels, on oh, no, oh, hooker, like you can see there is the banana, there you had the banana quest, 
on, oh, on yeah. cemetery mm-hmm. thing. I can remember yeah. some keys and stuff. So even like you can see even the last login page, see two thousand and three. Yeah, I was like fourteen, I think maybe. Uh-huh. Wow. Yeah. So, and and did you have like a, a computer that you would play in your house, I suppose, or was this in the land houses or like uh, cafes? No, it was it was my house. Always okay. my house. Oh, good. I, I barely I barely played on because the land houses back then used to have a lot of keyloggers. Oh, yeah. And people are trying to hack each other, so I just like yeah. decide, decide not to, to try that. Okay, know? okay. Not, not jeopardize my stuff. Okay, now me. So you started as a test server, then you went and moved on to some room. But like in Mediva itself, like wh- when did you start it? Or was yeah, that always, Medi- always Medivia, your thing? Yeah. Uh, Mediva, I started back on Novus as well. Okay. Uh, you can see like that. My first piece I, I show uh, the first piece I showed you that was like the premium scrolls. Yes. And then I also have here like, let me see if I can find here like some trades I did with the top rookstayer on on Legacy. Here, like some trades I did with him with Unmade. Let's see there. Okay. Loading. Like some stuff that I bought. Oh, I see some. Uh... Tapestries, are those tapestries? Yeah, the, yeah, those seem like are the blue, the blue are aristocratic trips or something. Uh huh. I also have more. Let me, uh, that was two thousand twenty. Oh, I see there I the, I, the flute. I think I have another one. Yeah, uh, I paid back then. That was like, the yeah, he was the the most collector on novels on here. Here on here on Medivia, so I decided to start collecting Novus too. Then I just started buying stuff on Legacy. Mm-hmm. Here I have another one. Let me see. Hold on. Let me try to find those. There is there is a lot of pictures here that that I can that I can share, but it's too many. Let me see. Okay, I showed you that one. People are saying Where to also show it? if you can, of course, to also show on the the stream. The, the screenshots. Oh yeah, like on 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 the Twitch. Yeah. Sorry, yeah. I, I'm showing on you on Twitch? the stream here. Uh, I mean, people can click. But because I'm... I want to hide your screen, but we aren't seeing anything. Yeah, that, but it's because the the screens I'm showing it's on the it's on the the Discord. But I can I think I can try to to share. I'll give you one second. Yeah, no, take your time. Let me try to open this here. Um, what is it? So while you I'm going to try to show this screen as well. Yeah. Let me research for okay. this Yoon Mei guy. Is he still playing? This okay, there. Yoon Mei guy is still playing? No, he no. quit a long time ago. Yeah, last time. See, I, 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 okay. I'm showing this screen as well, the pictures. This is like one of the, the greatest purchases I bought. You can see the, the Mystic Turban on Rook. On novels, and that's a that's a main that's a main item. Yeah. You see, so the history behind it, I think, was the the GM. What's the name of the GM again? Dolly. Dolly, uh, I think he he. Dolly, Doyle, I think that's yes. it. Doyle. Doyle. Yeah. yeah, he he teleported someone to novels. That's the that's the the story I heard about. Not sure if it's completely true or not. But he teleported someone to Novus and like gave him like five seconds to do something. Yeah. And then you had the flu and he, he was able to pass over the Misfit Turban and the and the flute, I think. Oh, in and five the seconds. tapestry. Okay. Yeah, like and the, and that and that warrior tapestry you can see there as well. On my stream and yeah. also on the yeah. Because like on there's the no way to acquire a Mystic Turban. In Novus, right? Ever? Yeah. Like, okay. So no. that's that's why people believe it was Doyle that TP'd someone, and they were able to make the trip. Okay, interesting. All right. Yeah, that, and that was like back then. You could you talk about like four years ago. Yeah. Uh, I paid, I think, for all those items. I paid the the. I was. I think it was two times. Oh, I think it was like the 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 five point four. KMC spec back then, but yeah, didn't okay. exist. It was a lot, so it was like twice the two, 
was like twice the 2.7k. Yes. Okay. So the 5.4k directly from store didn't exist. So you had to buy twice the two point. Okay. So you, yeah, so, so that's about it. like 300 euro for that, that the items were. Selling. Yeah. Back then. Yeah. Back then I think the price was still 300 euros. I think it was still 300 euros. Oh, okay. Interesting. Yeah, I think so. I'm not sure if it changed. Yeah, but I'm was sure like the, cheaper or not. Yeah, the Brazilian real was way more valuable compared to the euro back then, I suppose. But, yeah, yeah. I have like other pictures here too. Let me share here. Like, oh please, yeah. I think that was like my here, like my whole collection on novels. Okay, you still have it, by the way. No, I sold it you like sold, okay. since I moved. Yeah, because since I moved to to mainland, mm. the I stopped. Uh, I decided to sell all my my hairs on, on Opus. Yeah, and then let me let me share here also. Okay, there, show it on the stream. So you can see there there are like insanely hairs there on Opus, like the the golden amulet there that drops from. Uh, from the ancient scrub, yeah, the scrub, the ancient amulet. It was possible to get it by fishing. Yes. You can still get it, but mm -hmm. like very rare. And you got it on novels. You oh. can see the the EP. The EP is mm -hmm. just possible to obtain on novels. You cannot obtain anywhere else. It's a drop from Bonny Beast. Really? Okay. So that's yeah, it's really cool. Also, like the Mystic Turbo that I talked about, and the the Christmas ring. Was also like extremely hard to obtain. Yeah. No, about the EP. So yeah. the we we have bone beasts in mainland, but you're saying that the bone beasts in Novus only it's the only mob that drops that EP. Yeah, because the the bone beast on Novus is like a addicted one. It's oh. like weaker. It's weak. It's a little bit weaker. Yeah. And drops. I think also drops idle hammer. You can check that on wiki yeah. on wiki channel yeah. you can see like there is a bony beast novels and yeah. bony beast the main name i see that you here, know yeah. you can see that and the bony beast novels they drop iron hammer you can see on the top of the screen yeah and also yeah. drops the ep also drops a uh, 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 white tapestry so it's a completely different mod yeah. you know mm -hmm. just the same name just a completely different mod that's it interesting okay so pretty much that yeah and let me see if i have another phone novels here uh, I have the that picture I showed you about. Ah, uh, I have this insane picture here that let me show it to you guys. Like, was a really cool picture. Was like a completely bug item. I got with my my friend Gorky. I think it was the first time. Let me put on the stream as well. Here. Yeah. Let me find here. Um, Okay, here. So it's a hot sword. Yeah, it's the hot. It's the hot sword from Wii, the the hot one boys on novels. Okay. But you can see it's completely bugged. You can see it's plus nine on on flawless. Oh. And it has gouge. You know, gouge yeah. on novels is like totally broken. Yeah. You know. <laughs> that was like yeah, we got this. We, while attributing it, we got this weapon. And after that, I we, we reported that to Eldrin, and Eldrin edited the, the hot by himself, the, the sword by himself, you know? Okay. And now the, the the sword has like a unique attribute attribute attributed by Eldrin himself. So it doesn't like it's not uh he had to uh, correct that right away because of yeah. like from other bugs. drops, okay. Yeah, so he just like before launch, launching a new, a new, a new update, like yeah. a patch, just to fix this. He decided to to just correct right uh, with uh, another attribute. So he changed the gout to, I think, was strength. Now it's strength, mm -hmm. but it used to be like that sword fight, sword fighting, but, uh, one more like melee skills. Yeah, you know. Yeah, and how much did you sell the this hot sword for? Because seems pretty valuable. uh i didn't so they still have it oh you still have it yeah look i'm gonna show you on the stream yeah you brought so some items of your collection you brought from novus just some of them yeah. sold okay 
Uh, by going down, let, let's okay. Let me just do one thing really quick because I don't want to reveal right now yeah. what's downstairs. Oh shit! I can't. So it's closed. Oh, no. Okay, I can't show the rattle because it's it, the door is closed with and my it's the other card that has the yeah. But it's okay. No worries. Okay. Wow. Interesting about the hot swords. So and then after that, after that, uh, after I decided to quit Nobus, like had nothing else to do there, I decided to go mainland and decided to search like start my own collection there. Mm -hmm. So my own collections. This is like I think it's the. Hold on, let me see. I think that's the first. That's the first picture I have from my collection. Here, there. I think that's my first. My first item that I got in the collection. That I got in the collection. Let me share the screen. The screen yeah. as well. Can you walk through some of the items? I know some of them. Like, is that a rogue helmet? Yeah. Let's see here. Okay. Okay, it's on string. So that's this is like my first collection. Like when I started to collect the collect in mainland, like I decided to quit novels for, for real. And then I bought the rogue helmet. I yeah. have no idea how much I paid back then. But for this. And then even this book, like I was I was always like a book person. I like it to collect the books. Yeah. And the omen dolls. Those dolls, they were reward to people that play on Strife server, that uh, PvP server, yeah. long time mm -hmm. ago. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And you can even see it's the old, it's the old. This feature is the old, the old sprite, because the doll changes right now. Oh, okay. Not those dolls anymore. Yeah. You can see that's the the laughing doll, the hell cheat or the druk. I see. And the other, the other old main dolls. Yeah. Those are like considered like extremely hair items. Oh, yes. Because I can't, I think I, I, can't, I categorize the the items by extremely hair okay. and units, like extremely hairs that you can find like like three plus like on, on the three to ten. That's like I'm saying extremely hair. Okay. That's why thunder. That's why thunder hammer. I don't consider that extremely hair item. It's a very hair item, but not extremely hair. Okay. And there is the Unix. The Unix are the only one existing. You know, only in, one exists. In all servers. Okay. Yeah, in all servers. In yeah. all the like I can show you because uh, I was pretending to show this 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 room. Okay. On the stream, like one we spoil or a bit of spoil of the ultimate hair event. So this event that I'm going to be hosting on 18 August. Yeah. You can see on my stream. Uh, Look, I'm going to go downstairs. I want to go there too. Yeah, okay. You can yeah, yeah. do it there and I'll try to take a screenshot. I'll, I'll okay. Your screen, yeah, see, and post it here. Just so people can follow if they're not on your screen. So. So. I can't walk all the way to the right because you can see here. Yeah. Like we see here on the map, or uh, like on the street to the right, there is yeah. the room with the most cool item that you can expect. The you know, the this most, is another most cool, cool item. Uh, most cool oh, okay. items that you can expect is here. Okay. You know, this room, I really don't want to, uh, I'm not going to show yes yeah. okay. on the event. You're waiting for yeah, the but event. here, mm -hmm. Yeah, but here you can see like, yeah, some like, it's, like this, the Dwarven Axe. The Dwarven Axe is a unique item. This the is Dwarven like the... is a unique item. Okay. Yeah, that's a unique item. Only one exists in the game. But this was like the story behind this leg was like insane. It was like one of the most the hard by far the has the hardest item I had uh uh was took like the hard the longest time for me to find. Because I think it took a lot, uh, like two to three years to find the owner of the legs. Huh. I always started back in 2021 when I did my first my first uh, event. I was trying to find like the the owner of Dobber legs, and all, uh, only only hint I had was the name of the person on the game. But then I checked it like he he had like three to four years like without logging. Mm -hmm. So how can you find a person like this? 
you know, it's it's pretty impossible to find. So I was like offering like MCs on Discord for people with like information about this the, the person and nobody had it like nobody knew him nobody ever talked to him or, or whatever so it was like just gave up like okay this item it's impossible to be fine to be found whatever can't find that and like when i was like a, i already gave up uh like idea came to my mind i was like okay every time i see someone posting on the on the on the on the discord like hey i i was like i was long time without play can you not help me mm -hmm. so that was like the only the only chance i had to find like information about this guy okay. so like every time i saw someone like on this discord speaking about it saying something like this i went to private message then and was like hey uh, uh, i i read that you you're a old player whatever blah 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 how do, do you happen to know this guy? And like, I it took me like one year, like asking random people around this. Mm -hmm. And like, when I got extremely lucky, one of the guys said, Hey, yeah, I knew him and gave me his Facebook. Oh, okay. so I messaged him. Like, I got really hyped about it. Like, oh my God, I can't believe I found it. So I messaged him, took six months to oh. him. Jeez. to reply to me yeah. because when you have you don't have him as friend in facebook like the message don't go to yeah. mm -hmm. the first page at all go to like another page so it took six months to him to reply then i started to negotiate with him and then suddenly so suddenly he stopped it to, to reply he and that, then i was like yeah he stopped replying he didn't like maybe gave up on, on selling i don't know mm -hmm. I was like, oh my God, I can't believe it. I finally found it, but the guy simply decided not to reply anymore. And then it took like another six months, maybe almost one year. Like he finally decided to reply. And, and then we started to negotiate, negotiate again. Yeah. And then he find I he finally like logged in and sold me dark legs. Mm -hmm. I still have the picture of that. And like that was like a very mo memory day for me. Can you share that picture and how, like how much you paid for it? Like, cause it seems to be like unique. Normally those are. Yeah. Let me show, let me share on the. On the oh, wow. Julian Legacy, Tescatu Poca. Well, that's the guy's name. Let's see when he yeah. last logged on. Maybe he's. Tescatu Poca. Was the guy Brazilian? No, no, I don't even know. And is it true? <laughs> like on the wiki, it says that he got the Dwarven legs by reporting a bug to Irions. Yeah, that's, you know, that's what we when, when some of those items come like from very old, very old, like it's like probably one of the Oh, I can't find, hold on, let me see. I can't find the, the picture here, garbage lights. I'm trying to share, to share on the, yeah, no, on the screen as well. Sounds good. But I can't find it, one second. Okay, I found it, garbage lights. Okay. This is the picture, guys. Yeah. So, uh, what are you asking again? I forgot. Yeah, like, uh, so the guy got those legs. He, the wiki says it's because oh. he reported a bug, but he, he could be anything else. Yeah, else. yeah. When, when it comes to items like this, you pretty much, like, uh, lose the track of even how it got there, mm -hmm. you know? But as the only thing I know is that, like, he reported a bug, like, a long time ago and got those legs. You know, as a, yeah. uh, from Iron, like as a thank you, as a thank you for reporting like critical bug, and yeah. he got it, and then I bought it. Okay. The price I had or not to say it, but oh. let's say it was okay. like, uh, was like one of the most expensive items I bought. Mm -hmm. Like I didn't even care. Like I just wanted that, you know, because just the 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 work I had to get it. Was yeah. like so crazy that I just said, "Okay, fuck it. Just tell me your price, and I'm yeah. gonna pay that." And then he said, "Okay, this is the price." I said, "Okay, blah." blah and then I got changed with him, yeah. and then I got it. Wow! Because it was like all the effort I had just to find it, and he finally logged in and stuff. I just said, "Okay, just give me your price, and I'm gonna pay for that." Mm 
Hmm. And that's like one of the most, not only expensive items that I have, but also like the most, the one that, the one that took me the most work to find yeah. it. You know, expensive was... in matter of time and money, I suppose. So, so two things. Yeah. The, yeah. Yeah. It was like, like when I had no hope, like the chances of, I seen someone saying on the Discord, hey, I haven't played in years. Can someone help? And then I yeah. just ask, uh, talk to him. He said, yeah, I know this guy. So it was like crazy. Yeah. Like great stuff. I think you answer a lot of the questions that I had here, but I'll try to uh, you know, skip some of the ones that yeah. you already covered. But yeah. you said that you have a system like like you have the uniques that's uh, normally goes for a set price and then you have your extremely rares right you said that those are five to ten do you have like a table or it's all in your heads how how do you define this and what are the no. different different tiers that you have uh it's pretty much i don't have a table it's just like things i i think about it okay you know just like because uh so, so uh i tend to be unique like unique the the description like of unique is like one item only you know like the door legs is one only one yeah is this this doll here shake bicep stall is only one as well mm -hmm. you know let me see another here oh the golden bug as you can see here yeah. there are two of them so it's not unique it's ex like it's or, or maybe you can call them the the first the the only one with one uh, with one type one in the in our server. It's super unique, and the ones with two to three like uniques, you know, just like to 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 categorize them yeah. and like separate the one the the ones that only one exists. You know, like this all here. And also, you can you can see others here like the the the, the double legs. Oh, I'm I'm showing the stream. Yes, I see I, I'm on the stream. Yeah. Okay, so you can see here, Dark Relax is unique and also a legendary item. So it's like, it's like one of the most desirable ones. And you can see here, like, I don't have a problem to show this because that's the house is going to be the event and it's already decorated here. Yeah. So you can see also the Bruton here. The Bruton, it's, okay, it's a unique item. Two of them exist. You know, and it's also, I categorize them as a legendary item mm -hmm. because, you know, it's from old Chibia, you know, so it brings like memories, it brings nostalgia. Yeah. So this item here is like a very desirable item as well, just like the same as the Dwarf Lights. But you can see like there are other like unique items, but doesn't it's not like legendary because not it doesn't have like a real history behind it. Yeah. Like, you can see this Chain Lord book. This tainted book, this book of secrets, you know, mm -hmm. they are all like unix. This book of secrets, I think there is two of them. But this chain lore book, it's doesn't have like a really big history behind it because yeah. you know it, it was like a, 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 a gift from, from medieval gods, but yeah. it's not like from old Chibia. Like you see, you go up here, you can see the yellow rose, like yellow rose. And the yellow spell wand, they are like very, very, very desirable long time ago from even Tibia. So those items are like crazy for me. Yeah. Yellow rose are two that exist, the yellow rose. You can see uh, one one of them, I uh, I got, uh, I, I don't, I one of them, and the other is Atron. They also have one of those. The yellow spell wand, you can find like, uh, so good amounts of them, good amount would say like between five to ten on whole medieval, mm. you know. So it's not like as hairy yellow rose. Actually, let me see. I think I have the yellow when I bought the yellow rose. I think I took the picture. Oh yeah, got it. Look, oh, this shit. is the picture of the yellow rose. I bought not only the yellow rose, but also the yeah, what's that? The dress? housewife dress. Oh, the house, housewife yeah. dress. Um, yeah, it's housewife dress. So that's like uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. But seven, that's bro. We are talking. We are. We are. We are talking about like yeah, like five five years ago on Legacy. How much was the MC back then? Like eighty. Oh, okay, it's kind of fucked on the on the stream. Let me try to. 
and try to fix this. It's yeah. So that's all uh, the strain is out of scale. That seems to be uh, twenty. Yeah, like two point two kk, or maybe yeah. That's all legacy. That's yeah. when like five years I ago. I think one. Saying. Yeah, that's like one hundred eight, one hundred MC on legacy. I think it was like a hundred k, a hundred fifty. Something like that. So just make the math. You can know. I would yeah. say around like one one k euro, something like this. On those cake on twenty two kk is here. I would say something around this for those for those two items. Wow. Th those are like one of one of the first that I found the yellow rose and the house the housewife dress. Yeah. These are those are like a very very house very expensive. Dress. But I'm check here. Three. I think it's here. Beans. Okay. I'm checking weekend on every item you say, just so I, I get All a right. bit more contests because I, I have no clue on those items. If you guys have any questions here on the Discord, let us know as well. Well, that's pretty impressive. Se vocês tiverem alguma pergunta aí, gente, tanto no Discord como na stream, é só perguntar aí também que eu vou responder. Yeah. Send it away. And then you said that usually, right? Like if it's a unique, uh, I mean, it goes depending on the item, right? But a unique item yeah. normally goes for the the most expensive 5.4k Medivia coins package, like which is about 330 euro. Is that right? Normally, no. that's your first offer, or how does that go? No, that actually that depends a lot. The the, the market on those ex extremely hair items, the hair collector market marketing. Yeah, it depends on like a lot of variables. Mm -hmm. Like depends on it. Pretty much depends on how much do you want it. Yeah, and how much the person is wanting to sell, you okay. know. So that's like the base, you know. For example, the dwarven leg that I showed here, the dwarven leg that I showed here, like I was so crazy for that. Like it was like three years trying to two years trying to find the owner. Then he replying to me and then stopping to reply it was like he had a big history behind it, like a lot of effort trying to find him. Plus. It's a legendary item from like old Timbia and stuff. So this, I didn't care. Like whatever price he said, I said, okay, I'll pay it. Okay, of course, if he said like 10k euros, I'll not pay that. Okay, yeah. but like yeah. on the on the on our reality, yeah. I was like, I was I was I was so into it that I didn't even want to negotiate. I was like, okay, tell me your price and I'm gonna pay that. Mm -hmm. You know, so pretty much depends on how much do you want the item. And how much the guy is wanting, willing to sell? Yeah, like the like the golden bug here. The golden the golden bug here. I bought from another hair collector. Like one of the first questions that you that you did on start of this uh -huh. interview. Like you're like I'm one of the collectors as well, but there are like a couple more that you can find. Like I would say, like the second top collector on the game. Like. He also loved collection. Uh, actually, I gotta thank I gotta thank a lot to him. Not mm -hmm. sure if you want me to say his name, but I can say it. I think I can say it. Oh yeah, you can. It's Tutor. I think it's Shiderex. How to say that? Shider oh, Shiderex. Shiderex. Is he a collector? Didn't know that. Yeah. He, yeah. He's an ex like, yeah. Shiderex, I think is what's pronounced. Shiderex. Yeah, he's like one of my best friends on the game. I am indeed. And he, yeah, and he also. He he also is lending like borrow borrowing because you know all this all this event I gotta think some people you yes. know because they are actually borrowing some items because it's impossible oh. like to make I would say like seventy percent of the items are mine mm -hmm. and thirty percent of the items are like from people that are borrowing me trusting me and borrowing me yeah. the, those items for example like from Shaderax you can you can see like. I think I lost your. Am I still audible? Maybe I lost him. Can you guys hear me? Oh, oh, I, I think, think I think you cropped out. It. Here, yeah. I'm back. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I can hear you now. Okay, I'm back. Yeah. Okay, so You're from Shadarax, I think the uh, the golden bug, it's him. It's oh. his. The the rogue set, it's his. The spider set, it's his. The oh, the spider set. The white set. wing. Yeah, the spider chain set is also from him. There are other stuff like those, those, those books here. Those books here are also his collection. Oh, okay. So it's not mine. So, so like there is also this event, you have people helping you with some. It's not everything you're a collector. That's what, like, 
I mean, the trust, right? Because those items are worth it for them anyway, like, and for you guys, yeah. for anyone willing to pay, like they're, they're worth a lot of money and like how your password, it's probably like 24 characters long. Um, just well, because uh, you don't yeah. want to get hacked, right? Because it's insane. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, not 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 that, but not only that, but I also like I talked to the to the Medivia Medivia staff and Shuna, yeah. the, the map editor. They he's like he's going to edit the map. I think I showed before. Like he's going to edit the map. You can see there's only one corridor here. You see, uh -huh. like on the event day. Let me see if I have a picture here. Uh, on the event day, I think I have it. Let me see. Mm, I uh, I don't think I have it here. Maybe not. I did I did not separate. I don't think I separate here to show. But anyway, on the event day, Shun is gonna edit the the house so people can can move along like easier and better and without any problems. And all the doors will become not even I will be able to enter the the room so that like even if i get hacked somehow you know the person is not going to be able to get the items you know okay. and so you know see you see this door here so it's not going to be a door it's going to be a wall so nobody's going to enter this you know so and, and and by the end of the event like last year saffron uh was ready to at the end of the event he like delete it off one of the walls and then I return it like all the items to the person to the person. Mm -hmm. Also I think in all days like Mediva has like it has grown on security stuff. Yeah. And in terms of finding items, like I remember I saw I saw like one guy one guy got hacked and I think it was on Serenity. Mm. I think he got hacked. Something like that. And and Medivia like found who hacked him. Where was his items and like got the got the the main person banished the figure deleted? I don't remember, but got okay. banished. Not sure if managed to get the items back. So, like all the security, all the security items, yeah. all the security of the items. Like I'm doing the best to avoid any kind of stuff. Like, Great. Okay. Good to know. Um, okay. Let's see then. So... And also, and also, of course, there is like the trust behind it of because. There is like like I know not uh, Shadrack Knox for like over five years. We've been talking like doing deals together. Yeah. Like for example, the Godi bug. We bought the Godi bug and another item that I can't say it, but we bought those both those both items we bought together. Mm -hmm. So we share that, you know. So you, you know how and it's working. So it's like he's up because okay. it seems that like. You mostly collect and you have your ultimate collection of rares that you're showing there, some of them. But like do it's the majority of your business to buy and resell or just buy and keep it and do the expositions? Like, well, it, it's 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 hard to 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 resell those kind of stuff because in the end I'm always like paying over paying for those items because like mm -hmm. let's say for example if i paid 100 k and 1k euros for dragon eggs let's say that yes okay you know nobody no I, i'm sure nobody's going to pay that you know like we extremely hard to find like someone okay hey i want to pay that you know so like for this for the yellow rose how much i paid for that so, so most of the items i pay like so much for that that mm -hmm. i know that even if i resell them i'm not going to get back like not even half of yeah the the, the cash i i spend to get them okay so like i i don't i don't worry about uh selling those items uh, i don't really worry at all about selling those items okay. because i know i'm not gonna get like uh a super offer or anything yeah like for example those this the, the blue tone mm -hmm. i bought it and i sold it to shadrax Mm -hmm. You know, because I know he always loved books. Yeah. And he was like really crazy to complete this. And he says he was like a friend. I was like, okay, I'm going to sell to you for the same price. I bought it. So I was not looking like to profit anything from, from this. 
Okay. You know, so we negotiated and he, okay, okay, uh, I decided to buy it. And then he bought it. Okay. So you, know, you so... don't buy those rares as like as a means of investment to then later in the future when they are more valuable for whatever reason, then you make a profit. You're just keeping them as you're appreciating the item, but you don't really, are, you're not looking to resell this one day, I'm, I suppose, your collection of your rares. Yeah, that's it. I don't really look to 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 resell any of those. I really like to, as you, as you can see in the in the past, like I was like always a hair collector. I always love to have yeah. those kind of items with me. Like made me feel special as well, like in another way of playing the game. Because the game you can decide to like get high levels, yeah, or do all the tasks, or like get best Chiari like completed you can always you can always, you can always try to find a goal for that yeah you know but my goal here is to get the most the, the most collection like possible you know mm -hmm. that's my goal you see i have this card here for like i don't know three years like science serenity yeah. and look at my level so yeah. like i i'm not really an xp person uh -huh. i would just like to enjoy this kind of game that not really many people goes to to okay. like the hair, the hair, the hair collection, you know. Yeah. That's my, pretty much that. I don't plan to resell that unless, of course, if someone comes with an insane offer, yeah. And I'm like, okay, hey, I don't play anymore. I decide to quit the game, you know. But I'm not. Re I never look to to really profit about it. Only okay. if it's like, let's say, this item here, the Darwin eggs. Let's say I paid one k euro euros for that. Mm -hmm. This item, I really don't want to sell that. Like, I really don't want to sell this. But if a guy come, hey, I offer you 2k euros for that. I've got a profit 1k. Yeah, but I'm not really trying to profit. But the guy, because yeah. the item that I don't plan to sell and I don't want to sell. But like I always say, like many times before, all items are always for sale. Just mm -hmm. depends how much the person offers. Yeah. You know, but there are items that I really don't want to sell. Like this key here on the top. Like you see this key here on the string? Yes, can see it, yeah. Uh, this key here, you can see it's the silver key and the gold key of the same number, you see? Let me take a screenshot it, it, so I can post. So the silver key they and the golden key, they both have the same number. Yeah, the gold, this golden key, it's from Demo Hell. Mm. The OP is the Demo Hell, this key is uh, 6010. Yes. This key here is the same version, but silver. It doesn't up anything. It's like one very old bugged key. Yeah. That nobody knows where the fuck this came from, you know? Uh -huh. So it's crazy. Does it another also work? another eye that people no, it, it works work. the, Oh, it doesn't work on the demon how door. No. Oh, okay. No, no, just, it doesn't work anywhere. Okay. <laughs> It's just like a key that I, I always love it key. That's why th there will be a key room on the event. Like mm. all the keys outside the keychain. I, I already talked about it before. So it's not, not really uh, a secret. Like all the keys, the, the key the keychain, if I remember if I remember that is like 94 keys on the game. If you can put a keychain. I have one here almost full. You see? 89 keys on my keychain. It's missing 4,900, 4, 4, 4, 4, 4, oh, wow. and it's missing the the key from from Falcon. The, mm. I decided to leave it and to not leave it there. So there is total of 90, 91 keys, I think, for the game. Wow. And all those 91 keys will be displayed like yeah. outside King Chain on the event. So I was always like, I always love it key. So yeah. when this guy came with this item, I just love it. Once you put a key on the keychain, you cannot take it back, right? As a physical item. That's right. Yeah. Mm. And no, and you can't. Have you ever regretted putting a key on the keychain that you lost? Yeah. You have. The four, okay. Yeah. The, the, the four, the four, nine hundred. This one here. The four, nine hundred. Oh, okay. But it was on a, it was on another keychain. It was not on this keychain. Oh, okay. I see. And yeah. That, then I had. Yeah. I got the super. Then I had to. Then I had to find the. The another one of those to leave it outside keychain. Mm -hmm. It took me like another 
good good months to find this game the four nine hundred. And I paid this one I paid I think was two point seven K AMC just for this game. Four nine hundred. Yeah. That's you... crazy. Then in talking about keys and uh because I know like some people sometimes figure out something on a way of getting an item that people thought was rare, but now somehow they're not anymore. Have you ever bought an item and then it became like a common item, but you bought like... it thinking that it was rare? Um, and then yes. based on an update <laughs> yeah. or based on whatever, it became normal? Yeah, that was, I was like, actually it was like, Right when I came to mainland, start start my collection on mainland. Yeah, I was like, I remember roses are hair like from old tibia and whatever. And then I saw a guy selling a blue rose, and I wasn't like really aware of the wiki, the medieval wiki and whatever. I was like, oh my god, blue rose, that's really hair from old tibia, whatever not. Uh -huh. And I paid I think like eight, like I was like two or three kk. Oh. Back when, like, K, uh, when, like, 100 MEC on Pendulum was, like, 500k. Ooh. So I paid, like, a 500 MEC for, like, an item that a blue jean drops. Yes. You know? So that's, like, <laughs> so, like, that was, like, a really shitty stuff, like, got completely scammed yeah. like, uh, on the, on this item. But answer to your question, um, like you're saying, like I bought an item and then it became a fable of the game. Yeah, like Does an it? update. Like you know, we see updates mm -hmm. changing items every now and then, or new monsters dropping an item that wasn't before available generally. So has that ever happened to you? Like the staff did a made a decision that impacted your collection. Uh, let me see if I can remember well. I I can't really recall any of okay. those right now. Yeah. Like, like I remember I was talking to Saffron some time ago about the dwarven legs, mm -hmm. I think, but I'm not sure if it was Ed or not. Like on the game, I just hope not because. Oh, because the of the new dwarf dwarfs. Uh, they have new dwarfs now. Yeah. The chaos dwarfs or blights dwarfs or something. Okay. Yeah. So I'm like, I'm hoping, like, I'm crossing my, my fingers that he didn't got added because, yeah. like, for all the history I have behind this item, like, it's gonna, and all, not my history behind this item, but also the item history. Like, was yeah. one of the first major bug support I think gave by Iron. You know, I know, oh, okay, but the, the dwarf says it's missing the legs or whatever. I don't know. So, oh, what I can say is the one of the histories I, I remember now is the ego shield. You remember the ego shield from old Tibia? Yes. That didn't look very ego. nice, right? It was all <coughs> sprites, I think. Yeah, the ego shield was is not what you're talking about, but like it be, became unbeable or not. But the ego shield. It became the shield of unseen forces, mm. uh, oh, and, okay. but but after it became obtainable through the Magnal Opus quest, they changed the shield of unseen forces. This this eagle shield they changed to frost flame shield. You can see that on the on the wiki page. Mm -hmm. So that's like one of the items that used to be unique. But then, be, uh, then became obtainable through Magnum Opus. But to avoid like losing a hair, you know, for since it was like the Eagle Shield before, they changed the sprite and the item mm -hmm. from Shield of Unseen Forces to First Flame Shield. So it kept the the okay. item hair, yeah. you know, unique. Since it became available, you know, that's yeah. the I think that's the only item that I can think about it. Okay. And um, let me see, I have other nice questions here. Um, so what was the last rare you acquired? Uh, I'm not sure if I can say that. Oh, okay. you cannot the last... say it. Oh, wow. Yeah, because it's going to be on the on the event. Oh, but okay. I'm going to say the last, the last rare we, we acquired was me and Shiderax. Yes. Like the one that I told you about, we bought the, uh, like we talked to a guy that was another head collector on, on their game server. 
Okay. And we negotiated, and he only wanted to sell those two items. They go they buy this other item. Mm -hmm. He only wanted to sell it if it was both together. Mm -hmm. So me and Shiderex, like I invited Shiderex to join me on the deal because like it was expensive. And he said, okay, join you. And then this item, we share this item, you know, yeah. even the body bug and also this other item that is, is already sitting here on the, on the, the last one here, mm -hmm. but I don't want to go there. Okay. But that was like the last item, the last hair that I fired, if I can remember. Okay. And That's do it. you have your first rare that you acquired after going to a mainland? Do you have it there on the, your rare collection? What was it? Was it the rogue helmets or was one of the dolls? Was the was the blue rose? The blue rose. I don't have that. <laughs> that was your first one. Okay, you don't have that anymore. Yeah, that, uh, no, actually, uh, I went to buy the other blue rose. I actually have the blue blue rose here. Yeah. But now it's the premium, the premium rose. See, oh. it's not really a blue rose. Okay. It, it was not this one that I bought. It was a regular blue rose, <laughs> so I got it completely scammed. Okay. And this is the red one. Yeah. But the first item, answer to your question, I think it was the rope helmet. Mm. I think it was the first hair that I got when I got to me. And it's, it. uh, it's still there, right? I think I saw it somewhere on the downstairs. Yeah, but, no, but I ended up selling. I don't remember if I sold this. I think I, I think Shiderax, I think he can answer that better than I. I think this set, I think what used to be mine and I sold to him after the event. I'm mm. not sure if it, if that happens. Okay. I, I so it remember. could be I, that item, the exact same item, but you're not sure. Okay. Yeah. Understood. Yeah, it could be. And I'm not really sure. If they do. do you have a spreadsheet or like an Excel that you track everything you have? Because it's so many stuff, so much stuff. Like, uh, how do you like not forget that you have something that you already have? uh no i don't have that i, I just have like okay. pictures yeah usually i take pictures like with my full screen with all the items i have yeah you know and then i just like keep this safe you know but okay. i don't really i don't really keep track of those okay. all those okay and um you mentioned the most challenging item that you've ever had to get that was the dwarven legs that took so long right or was there anything else yeah like any other item no, that was by far the the hardest item I had uh, found it. Oh, interesting. Do you do you still have the guy's Facebook just in case? Uh, yeah, you I've do. been spamming <laughs> him because I know he has like two more hairs. Oh, he does. But yeah, but it, the the those two hairs he already told me like back then that he was not going to sell because belongs to the guild he used to play. Oh. You know, yeah. So he's not going to sell this. I have a picture, but this picture I don't. Want, I don't really want to share. That. You don't want it, okay? Yeah, but it's true. It's uh, they are items that are on the on the on the event, like on the exposition. Okay. It's gonna be on the exposition, okay? Yeah. And um, yeah. you mentioned oh, Shider Ice. Yeah, yeah Shider Ice replied here on my stream. Let's see. I'm sure you see it. Yes, sir. First items I bought to start my collection was the equipment sets, Rogue, White Wing, etc. Okay, from Dulhan. So it's probably that's your first rare as well there. The Rogue helmets. Yeah. Great stuff. And you mentioned Sidrex. Uh, hopefully we're pronouncing his name right anyway. By the way, my, my audio is coming out on your stream. Uh, I think so. Okay. I think it, yeah, yeah, it's coming. Yeah, okay. And... Um, do uh do, do you mention other collectors like are there many is there like a group you guys talk to or is you know every man for themselves and you you have Zyderax as your friend but you guys don't talk too much no we well, there is also like i would say i wouldn't say it's a group but it's like i would say like around five people that Probably like the ones that are donating here to the event, like helping with the, the exposition. Mm -hmm. Not sure if I can if I can say all the names, but one of them is Shiderax. Yeah. Other is Kaigo. Actually uh, is a guy that I met like three years ago. He started to play the game. Mm. And he just was like crazy to complete the the meteorite set, you know, the sword, yes. the weigh yes. the crossbow. 
and also the great sets. And then mm -hmm. we started to talk, you know, and then we became really good friends. He's also donating some of the, his items to the exposition. Okay. So I got to thank him as well. Another one is Sheku. Heck, Shekutranist. I'm not sure if I'm speaking his name correctly. Not sure. Uh, Shekutranist. It's this here. Let me type here. He's, he's also actually listening to me, Chief Kuchemist. Yeah, he probably, I think he pinged you there. Yeah, he, then number yeah, 642, yeah, he, uh, Les Claypool, is that his name? Yeah, he, he has a lot of characters. Yeah. Oh, okay. He's also like, he's also, he's another collector. He's also, his house is actually on Falcon. Mm -hmm. You can see it there. He has a lot of collections. He has the, the Omen dolls he has. Nice. And he has other things. He's also like helping on the event. There are other people that are like, like, let me go upstairs here. The ITs are not here yet, but on this, on this, this room here, you can see there will be, there will see the GPs here. Those GPs will be walls during the event. The Xuna will be, you will, will add walls so people can't pass by and get the items. <laughs> yeah. But here on this room here, oh, actually you can see the crawl here. Crow is another really cool item. Oh, is that like unique? Crown. Yeah, it's unique. Let's see, crown. That's a lot. That's a, another item that it has a. It's a legendary item from old, 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 old Chibia. Yeah. You know the crown. That's like a really cool item as well. But there is like there's missing some items here that comes from another hair collector. It's Panini. I think that I have brought to speak his name. It's Panini Martin. He has the golden dog that used to be from Kopec, the old tutor, Kopec. Yes. Mm -hmm. I bought from him the golden dog that Saffron, I think, gave to him after he helped on test server or something. Nice. Okay. So there is the golden dog that is going to be here. It's also from him. Yeah. So we have uh, me as collector, Shiderax. Uh, Shekuchanist, uh, Panini, and there is another one that he bought some of my, some items that I had on the first event, but I, I was like, okay, I'm not really attached to those items. We do we want them? And he said, okay, I'll buy that. Okay. But I don't, I don't, uh, his name, I don't think he, he likes to, to go oh. public because he don't want people like spamming him. Yeah. But between us, we know who he is, you know, okay. so like this small community we have, like at, at least at least here on Pendulum, you know, because there mm -hmm. are other hair collectors like on Destiny, there is like the Favorito, the Irman Claudette, yes, like an old BR player, he uh -huh. also a hair collector, along with Samioka, Samioka, uh, yes. Yunagi. Yes, Yunagi. yeah, mm -hmm. they are. Yeah, they're also like hair collectors. Oh wow! But on Pendulum, like on Pendulum, my I would say like my group, like my small group, is us. It's me, Shiderax, Shakutanis, Panini, and this other guy that nothing he wants the, the name to be named. So, to be, okay. To be named, you know. How has it been three days since the anniversary event, and you already have all the golden statues on the top floor there? The you have the two Lightbringer heroes, I think, and the the GM statues. Yeah. Like, did you, did, yeah. how did you farm those? Like, did you have stored like the anniversary coins? No, I actually bought on legacy. Like I paid, I paid 100 MEC per 1.5 K anniversary tokens on legacy. And okay. it happened to be like legacy. There's a lot of, of like, let's say char lovers yes. on legacy. Mm -hmm. So like I bought from like about almost 40k tokens on the on legacy and then I transferred over to here yeah. and then I just like did a lot of roulette, you know, oh, like crazy roulettes. Yeah. And <laughs> in different characters, and, I guess, because you have the three yeah. limits, right? The limit. Yeah. yeah, in different characters, like oh wow. I don't know, like it was like tr almost two to three full accounts doing oh. those, doing those spins, you know? Yeah. So I spent like a lot of tokens at the first and the second day as well, I like already got at least the, the now items from the round of decoration. Yeah. Like on the roulette, I think I got all them. That's the, the, the statues, the statue here. Yeah. The GM and the, the hero one, I think. 
Yeah. Yeah, the, the golden bookcase and the, the golden hangable shield and the golden sabers. I think wow. those are the five the five items that you can get from the Honda decoration. Yeah. And then luckily on the second day, I got the minecart outfit mm. on my character, you know, because yeah. I not not only got I got on my character, my main character, but I also got like on the on a shitty character, like a level oh. 109. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Because you cannot transfer. It doesn't come as a scroll, right? It just goes to your outfit uh, thing. Yeah, yeah. It go, just goes straight to your, yeah. your character. Unless you get, like, for the second time. Mm. If you get for the second time, then at least nobody got it yet. But Eldrin, I talked to Eldrin, and he confirmed oh. to me, like, if I get another minecart outfit, I get the scroll. Good. Okay. Good. You know, so... And, um, okay, wow, so uh, a lot of uh, collectors there, you know, and um, let me see, let me see, I, I have other questions here. Uh, have you ever dropped, like, one of the items that you, like, because you're talking about, like, normally acquire those rares, but have you ever, like, went after, either through a quest line or whatever, um, or crafted those like the meteorite sets like or do you normally go after the person has gotten the item you approach them to try to buy or do you do you also appreciate or do you also normally try to go after some of those rares yourself well the first item i crafted was golden but golden boots was one of the first golden boots mm -hmm. on pendulum and not only i went after like I was like crazy for those boots and really want to be the first to to make it. Yeah. And for example, this boots like I was checking the the golden the the spots the mining spots with golden ore, like yeah every like one hour. So I was like really addicted trying to get those those boots. Yeah. You know. So I would say like that's the first one that comes to my mind. Like when I really want it and I don't see like people selling it or yeah. whatever. I just like like uh, I I level up like some miners as well miners account you know that oh. take ages to level up yeah so just to like the miner campers you know because it's so three, much like three point five thousand gold bars to do a gold yeah bars. it's a lot it's yeah. a lot I, of course of course I bought some bars yeah but like half of it I was like me going after that. Also for the materials, the materials are also like the first ones I made it was also like this. I also have the like the one here. Let me show you the one. This one still have my name, and that one. Mm. This one was before like they add the change name stuff on Grassland. Yes. The... So this one I crafted myself. Like I bought a lot. Of, of course, I bought some of the the bars, but. I also put like miners all over the, the, the map and all the mm -hmm. meteor the mm -hmm. meteor places to oh. to grab the most most possible. Yeah. Here, I meteor is mine here. Thanks for answering that. Yeah. And um are there yeah. any specific items that are unique and you are still trying to get them? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, but, yeah. Can you say it or you yeah yeah no problem i can say it. it's just like this one is i'm going this one's like it's a it's more i would say it's more this i'm uh, more decept more decepcionado the, the, disappointed a, yeah yeah more disappointed than the dwarf and eggs one oh i see you showed the, the the, the met meteorite uh ones there which by the way i think is the only one with three palm so it, it's quite useful for a mana seating i guess uh, anyway, yeah, yeah. back to oh, your yeah the the item is the rose shield. Ooh, the rose shield yeah. is okay. like, but the most disappointing thing from the rose shield, and uh, not only the rose shield but also the feel, the potion of might. If you see on the medieval on the medieval medieval wiki, the potion of might and the rose shield, of because. Might. It's the same. It's the same drama, you know. You find the person. The person. The person doesn't play the game anymore. He don't care about the game. He probably like 
has a lot of money, you know, yeah. and then don't, can be can can like don't care about logging on the game and even checking or even selling something. So this guy, uh, I was on the track for the host shield mm -hmm. and also the pot of might. I had I had names. Hello. Okay. So no, can I can hear you. Yeah. So you're okay. you so you know who has those items and you try to get uh, from them but they don't want to sell it yet or they are not replying to you or let's say the the bunch of mind yeah i know who has it but he doesn't reply to me anymore okay and the, the, this is the same guy this the same guy that has the bunch of mind he knows and ha and has contact with the guy who has the rose shield the rose shield okay you know so, but since he doesn't apply to me anymore so i'm like yeah okay this is like one of the items that I probably like won't have it so whatever and do like are those two items unique or they are like exist more than one in the game the rose shield the rose shield is unique the rose shield okay. is unique only one existed but the potion of might like it's like it's a like it says on the on the wiki it used to be on the snake tongue collection desk yeah what's, you know what's that task? so no idea i don't know that's before that's before i played the game <laughs> yeah first i'll play the game is it from so, snakes i guess or yeah i think that's probably like you had to give like the the snake tongues to some npc yeah and then we would we'll give you the punch of might interesting something like that i think yeah but like I, will, I, I can't really like confirm that is it's unique or not. That is probably like some loss on very old characters, you know, yeah. that people lost their access or something. But like, if you really ask me, I would say it's not unique. Yeah, you know, like there's probably like more than like two or three loss in some kind of lot, very old characters. But in general, since it's lost and those characters lost as well. If you find one of them, you know, I would say it's it's considered unique, you know, since the others are lost. Okay. That would be so my, my... You're saying that when you get your Rose Shields and your Potion of Mites, then you might be in peace. Those are the only two items you're currently in the lookout for. Uh, Let me check here. I think... I think there are more. Let me check on the... Oh, there are one. Okay. Yeah. Oh, interesting, because if someone's listening to the recording or someone is here in the chat yeah. and they have one of those items, just speak to Dolan. Let me see here. I doubt it he has. Look, ah, another, the Broken Great Shield. The Broken Great Shield, like, I know who has it. And broken he was uh, he was actually talking to me yeah. on, my first, on my first event. On my first, oh, 2021, my first event, he had it on Legacy. He was talking to me. I made like a very high offer, and he said, "Hey, bro, I'm rich. I don't need money. Oh. I just want to have one item, like as unique as like a memory, like yeah. as a memory from the game that I play. You know. So when it comes to that, like you can't really, yeah, you know, I mean, it's, it's hard. So. So the, this, this Captain item, Mavuto I, guy is that is that his name Captain Mavuto? He did the recycling no, events. Guy. That's what the wiki says that uh, the broken great shield is the guy that. No, it's there. another. It's another. He changed his name. Oh, I have. Name. It's Captain something. Oh, okay, Captain I don't really want to say the name as well. Okay, no, no, no worries. <laughs> so the staff awarded him this broken great shields um, for doing an event and then he says he doesn't want to sell okay because yeah. he wants to keep at least one item that reminds him of the time he used to play yeah, the game. yeah okay makes yeah. sense I there, mean, are, there are other oh. yeah i'm sure you can relate okay. to that like sometimes you wouldn't sell some of the items that you have so i think it's the same yeah like if if i decide like let's say like okay let's sell my collection like i would probably like keep the the silver key like I told you, yes. The silver key is like one of my most desirable item, and the dwarven axe. Okay. So those are like the Your the ones that I most enjoy. Yeah, yeah, I I don't really think I would ever sell those. Interesting. And like, and since you spoke about it, and sorry to interrupt you, but like, let's assume 
like a millionaire is listening and he's interested in everything you have, including the, the, the key and including the legs, the dwarven legs, like, would you, would you know a number from your head that would say, okay, I would sell everything for that? Uh, I don't Just know. a random well, number. You could, is, is that a too crazy well, of a question? Well, it's, it's, it's a question that I knew. Uh, uh, actually, uh, uh, I, I almost talked to Shiderex about it. Yeah. Like, I was like, hey, how much do you think my full collection worth it? Okay. We we're actually like talking about it. And I, I, I threw like a random number to him. Like, you think like around 10K USD, like okay. 15K USD? He, I, if I remember well, he said, no, bro, way more than that. Way more. <laughs> so, yeah. well, he's yeah, in the like, chat here. Well, let's, let's try to get a evaluation from Cyderex. Mm -hmm. Tell us, Cyderex, uh, how, how much you feel at the moment. But interesting, like 10, 15K, uh, which is not like, if you think about it, it's not that crazy of an yeah, amount. If you think, if you think like the, just like, just the, I would say just the yellow rose and the, and the housewife dress. Like the amount of money I paid for just for 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 the yellow rose for the the dwarven legs and like for some other things they're like like one 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 third uh, like one one third to do so yes a third one yeah other, like yeah a third of that like something something okay. around so it's not like really crazy yeah it's hard to like put a number or something like this yeah try to okay. reply like at minimum given the time and the fort as well. Yeah. As the cost of obtaining the items taken take minimal. Okay. So, yeah, like, I would start, like, from that. You start just, from Just, like, they go to it. Yeah, it does negotiate, see, like, where... Of course, I would, like, make a cheat about it. Like, yeah. see... Try to remember how much I paid exactly. for that. For, for those, so to start at a base, you know? Yes. Because, of course, I don't want to lose money. Yeah, of course. I you know, don't want to lose like how much I paid for those. So I okay. could, I would start like at that base and then we go check, negotiate with the guy how much and then we do come like with, hey, how much do you want this item? Yeah. Because this item I don't really want to sell. Like Dorman X, I don't want to sell them. Like, yeah. oh, if I pay 1K here, I don't want to sell it. And oh, okay, but I really want that. Give me your price. Like the same that I actually talked about the, the guy that sold to me. Mm -hmm. You know, then it comes from there, then can maybe go uh, a little bit more. You know, than expected. Something okay. around this. Okay. No, good to know. No, thanks for answering, by the way. I know it's not an easy question anyway, and you, you know, it might be different, but so you would think about if someone came to you after the event was done, like uh, 15K USD on picks, you would think about it at least. Like, it's not that you were not willing to sell at all. You, 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 you um... would think about it. Or maybe it's not the moment, uh, even for the right price. It's not the moment for you right now. Uh, no, right now, like right now, since I got, I have a good job. You know, yeah. it's paying me well. Uh, I don't see this like I don't see I'm selling unless the guy really come with a really good offer. Yeah. Like I'll try to sell it. But like before I got into the navies, like I was just teaching. I wasn't making that much money, money yeah. that I'm making right now. So as you see, like before I sold the, like one of my, my items here, I sold for like, for like half of what I paid because I needed cash back then, you mm. know, something like this. Makes sense. Yeah. Uh -huh. So it pretty much depends like on the situation you have right now. Okay. So right now I don't really plan to sell it unless it's for like another friend that's a collector. Like okay. let's say, the, let's say Shiderax wants the, the full Rose collection. Yeah. That I'll talk to him about it. I mm -hmm. say he wants that. Okay, the, this items, uh, this items, I, I like them. The yellow rose is really cool. But since it's him, like we could negotiate the thing for the first thing price I bought. You know, yeah, something like this. So pretty much depends also the friend I have because also I know if since it's him, if I ever want to, to get the those item again to check it. Since we have like a big trust, I'm gonna mm -hmm. have no problem at all at selling to those people. The thing is, I, I don't really like to sell to random people because science like when you have when you have like a big history of the game on your hands, you have like a big responsibility with them as well. Yeah. Like, you know, like let's say the the Dwarven Knights. Okay. 
let's say okay, uh, a guy wants to buy. I don't know the guy. I have no idea who he is, and he comes in with a uh, with an offer, like let's say two k euro offer. Like if he comes for offer like this, and I was like really needing cash about it, I was like first talk to my friends. Hey, say I have this offer. Are you interested or something around around somewhere around that? Like maybe a little bit less because you're my friend. Like let's say if ah Shadra comes and offer me one point five k euros. I had to sell to him because I know the item the item is safe, you know? Yeah. The item is not gonna be lost or sure. deleted or like you know, you, yeah. you don't end you don't lose the history of yeah. the, the game. You know, so I had to like lose five hundred euros, but to sell to a friend and to know the history would be maintained. Yes. Then just like sell to random and the this the history is lost, you know okay. what I mean? Yeah, no, 100%. You want to sell to someone that shared the same enthusiasm for, you know, the, the collection yeah. as you have, not not someone that is just buying for, for the sake of it. That makes sense. And Yeah, or, or resellers as well. But I'm, like yeah. nowadays, sadly, there are many resellers on the game, you know, and like, I don't really want to like resell some of them because I know they're just going to, they're not, they, they won't uh, admire the, the item that how it should be admired exactly you know what i mean okay no no i 100 no. understand and i think it's one of my last few questions and i'll open to anyone here on this court on, on the stream as well in either portuguese or english whatever you want to ask uh, it's your chance to ask Dolan because i know by the time the event's happening he's going to be very busy um so do ask any questions that i haven't asked so far guys anywhere if you do have them but my last question would be, you you always talk about like, oh, I transferred this from Legacy to Pendulum, this Pendulum to Legacy or whatever routes you take. How many transfer scrolls do you think you've ever purchased <laughs> and used? Oh man, that's a really tough question. That's a really tough question. I think you have to ask Eldry about it. Oh, yeah, I would yeah. say like, <laughs> You at minimum, can see, yeah, on the system, I guess. I, at minimum, I would say like above twenty. At minimum. Oh, okay. The uh, like uh, one of the good things was like I don't think uh, you probably remember that, but like one month ago, we had like those free transfers to Pendulum, you know, mm -hmm. from other servers. So I think just on those on that period on that two months free free transfer, I think it transferred like around. <laughs> like 20 times you know yeah because uh, uh like that was free transfer uh and i got like paid like some extras so i could like buy other hairs and stuff you know so i just bought like a lot of hairs back and trust yeah. me a lot of that Be because you said and not really as a rare but more like as a, a like a business not not actual business but like a, as a businessman like you normally you look up for merges and servers that are going to be merged. And then you normally look for opportunities to try to, you know, make some profit out of that. Is, is that something you do as well? Yeah, I think, I mean, if we live in a capitalist world, I think if you see a chance, you know, yeah. if you see a chance, you're going to take it. Yeah. Like, for example, I was all serenity with this the, the cartel Dolahan. I was of all serenity. It yes. was like kind of new server before yeah. Pendulum became no 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 PvP. True. So yeah. what what I did there, like I knew, like the the items of serenity worth like way more than on Pendulum. Yes. Like for example, angelic legs full attribute full, full attribute, like on, on serenity. Was like 1.2, 1. 1. 1.3 MC, KMC. Wow. And on Pendulum and Progeny, that was like dead, the, like we're dead by then, dead market and everything. Yes. They're like going for 300 MC, mm -hmm. you know? Yes. So, of course, what I did, I sold on the old Serenity, made work, uh, transfers, like work trade transfers, yeah. you know? Uh huh. Yeah. And then bought like, shit ton of items like about my full my 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 piece equipment like my full items on on pendle and progeny with like selling two items of serenity 
Okay. And all the rest, like I sold everything, like my bike, my my keychain, everything I had for Serenity, I sold for NCs, was traded to Project and Pendulum and bought stuff there. Yeah. You know, so I could with equip my knight, my druid, like full equip and still had some MC leftovers. Yeah. You know, that's like think you end up like seeing the stuff. Yeah, which is completely allowed. Like, I mean, the, there are yeah. no rules against it. As you said, like, uh, it's about understanding the game and trying to, you know, um, see yeah, the opportunity yeah, and, and then and then try to capitalize on top of it. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, yeah and I didn't like we sold anything. It was like, I didn't got like, let's say, uh, not abuse, but like, I didn't, I didn't, no, no, passei a perna. To, to yes, you, know. you didn't like. Uh, uh, I scammed how people. Scanned, yeah, uh -huh. yeah, I didn't scam anyone. I sold for the right price on a server, yeah. or trade for another that the price is lower. You know, yeah. so I took like I saw an advantage, and I was like, yeah. okay, and I wanted to transfer to Pendulum anyway because all my items was here, like this keychain here, this full keychain I had here on Pendulum. Or serenity, I didn't have uh, like my keychain was like I don't think your I don't screen know, like, is which... your screen, but uh, you're sharing on the screen. Oh, right? I think it's okay. only on the giveaway. Yeah. The okay, so the, my keychain here, this keychain, I had this here on pendulum. Yeah, the keychain. Uh, oh I yeah, the before. keychain you were sharing. Yes, yes. Without the yeah, I had this. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, I had this here on pendulum. On serenity, my my keychain was like shitty one. Yeah. You know, so and of course more items as well. So it was like my my full my full uh, life medieval life is here on Pendulum. Yes. So I was like really hoping to come here and get like all this I had already. Yeah, and just as a tip for anyone like watching that once a tip anyway. Do you see people are talking about a possible merge between I think it was is a progeny and the turn? Is that the two that are gonna possibly be merged? In yeah. Jericho? Yeah. So, do you, are you yeah, planning probably. any any activity there, or some sort of uh, rare, or even markets, uh, you know, purchasing no. and selling? No, no, no. Well, I don't really have time for that anymore. Yeah. Like, because so it, it uh, takes a lot of time. I, I mean, it's not only adver advertising one and then you know just selling the other. Like, it, yeah, it, it takes a lot of effort to do that. Yeah, research effort. Yeah. Okay. But there are probably like a lot of resellers doing that, you know, but just not worth like my time anymore. Okay. I'm just like, okay, with what I have, you know, and if I need MCs, like I, right now, like with my current job, anything, I just go on the website and buy that. Oh, so, okay. Or you know, Curse Diamonds. Really like uh, do, do you also that. use Curse Diamonds? <laughs> or you, yeah, you buy straight from the website? Uh, I, li I like to buy straight from the website because yeah. of the strip. You know the the ten, the, the ten the percent more yeah. and yeah the mystery box and the, also yes. the the back the I think all the all the, the the plus that you get like worth it true uh, yeah. worth more you know especially the mystery box that you can open and find like some really cool yeah. stuff. What was you know? the best thing you've ever? As a last question, what was the best thing you've ever found found on the mystery box? Was well, child outfit. Oh, the, you you got that. a child outfit. Wow. Yeah, the but it was fun because I bought it. I bought the box like for I think it was a hundred MC. Yeah, I bought the box from like a random guy. He's like, "Hey, sell mystery box on yeah. trade." I said, "Hey, I, okay, pay a hundred MC. You accept?" I said, "He said, okay, yes, accept." And then I bought it and I opened it and it was a child outfit. Oh he was really pissed. Yeah. He was like really, really like pissed. Yeah, and I even asked it back. I said, "Hey, bro." That you sold to me, you know, that's my leg, like, like yours. I can't yes. really sell you back, like, you know, it's not really fair. Crazy. All right. Uh, I think that's it, man. Thank you for your time, by the way. Uh, and uh, before we go, let's let, um, do, you, do you like to say anything to close out? I mean, I'm still going to give you some chance to talk about your events coming up so you can tell everyone. Yeah. Again, I'm going to be publishing this on YouTube. So it's not only going to be the people that are hearing us here live, but anyone that he reads the uh, listens to the record on YouTube. So, uh, anything you like to say to close? Just, up? just, just see if anyone has like uh, because I wasn't looking at the 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 stream the stream channel at all. Oh, okay. Let's see if someone has any question 
Ah, se alguém tiver alguma pergunta aí, pode fazer na stream ou pode fazer no Discord também. Deixa eu rolar aqui e ver se tem. I'm trying to roll here, see if I have any question, because yeah, I uh, how much her. this guy spent this 2D, 2D game? Not to disrespect, just wondering, what do you what do you do for a living? Okay, that's our answer. Yes. Uh, qual o primeiro server que tu jogou? The first server I played. The first server I played was that, not sure if you played by then, Chief, but was, do you remember the pendulum when it was the, the test? was like a test server like only for three months and then it was deleted no you remember this Not my time yeah that was the first the first server i played it was panel was just like a temporary server like it was to be like three months and then was deleted oh wow. it was like reset it yeah. kind of like strife strife yeah okay uh, let me see if there is another question those are two for a quick got the right Uh, I don't think that is okay. Oh, not a stream. A stream. Ninguém mais tem uma pergunta aqui na stream. Deixa eu ver no Discord. Acho que também não tem mais não. Perfect. Yeah. So I'm gonna just say a couple things and then you can close out uh, explaining a bit of your ultimate rares. So for everyone that's listening, okay. Curse Diamond. Um, Curse Diamonds. It's an official Medivia reseller. They're sponsoring this uh, um, Medivia meetups. Uh, with 300 MC giveaway. So after this video is completed here, thanks again, Dolan, I'm gonna be posting the VODs, um, the video in on YouTube as a actual video. So you guys can listen to it again at your own time if you want or whatever you wanna do there. Uh, share with your friends that didn't have the chance to make it. And uh, you just comment hashtag Curse Diamonds. I'm gonna explain as well a little bit more on the video. You just hashtag Curse Diamonds on the comment section, and then you're going to be entering a 100 MC giveaway. So it's going to be three winners. So it's a total of 300 MC. So thanks again, Curse Diamonds. And thank you, Dolan, for making the time. And, and now I give you the floor to talk about your giveaway. Your, um, you're going to also announce the giveaway, the last giveaway, and you have the tickets going on for the premium, right? So yeah, please go ahead. Yeah. Okay, guys. So first, I'd like to check to thanks Chief for this opportunity as well to host this meetup with me. I hope you guys enjoyed some of the history behind hairs and history that I built up with this like five or six year playing Medivia and as a hair collector as well. E just related to the beard as well. Gostaria de agradecer. É, todos aí pela presença, espero que tenham gostado da, de um pouco da história de alguns, de alguns dos hairs aí, um pouco da minha história também. E now talking about the ultimate hair event uh, that I'm hosting, let me copy it here. It's on my stream right now, I'm posting there. The, my, my exposition event, the ultimate hair exposition, will be on 18 August. The hour, the time hours you can see is on the, the picture. What you can expect there, you can expect a lot of fun. You can expect you're going to be invited to, let's see, you're going to be invited to this house here. You can see on the stream. This house and also this house here. It's two houses that's going to be the, the event. Also, the event is going to be on Pendulum Server. It's going to be on the city videos. Uh, there might be a shortcut, not really, I'm not 100% sure about it, I'm still talking to Elgin about it, but there might be a shortcut from the Ashen Temple to, to here, like a teleport, so people don't have, like, people that comes from other servers, level 8, comes to here, don't have to walk out this way from Ashen to here, you know, and this house here is also part of the hairs event you see here on the top also would like to like i would like to spoil one of the the rooms the rooms that you, that you can wait on the event here i'm going upstairs here see on the screen you can see like the the decoration yeah we can see and some of the items you can expect Like here, 
there are some really hair, some really cool hairs here. So, some of you might not know, but some of you might know the stack of rooms. The this SD and this explosion. They are also very hair. How come they are hair? Because they are they have a hundred a hundred chargers and they only weigh one point two. That was like on the first time the uh, rooms come from the come from store. It was had with a bug a bug uh, bug caps capacity. Yeah. So I that people one, yeah. bought it and kept it. The, the, those two as well. I think it's all them. The GFB, yeah, the GFB, the HMM, the explosion room, and the SD. You can see the the rooms from the shield buses as well, and the stacker rooms. Here you can see like the 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 desk, the desk amulets and rings. Some of the bo boss drop as well, like watcher and ruby ring. You can see the shia shell amulet, the broken amulet, tougher amulet, others, and the omen hairs here. This is one of the rooms you can expect. Of course, there 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 will be a wall here, so people don't take it. There will be a wall here and here. That Shona, Shona will make those well. Uh, ser só dando um spoiler para vocês aí também do evento aí que vai acontecer dia 18. Also, you guys can expect the giveaways that I'll be doing during this event. Okay, I will be doing. Let me actually, let me even. I forgot to put the image back. I will be doing three giveaways during the event. Eu vou estar fazendo Dois giveaways durante o evento. O evento começa ao meio-dia, né? E de duas em duas horas vai ter um giveaway. Tá? Vão ter outros giveaway também feito por streamers que estão dando suporte ao, ao evento. Por exemplo, a Mia, o Nitro Minds e outros aí que eu vou doar para eles sem MCs. Sem MC, eu vou dar para eles sem MCs para eles poderem fazer é, giveaway, né? Para o pessoal que, que segue eles, né? Para eles não ficarem também vendidos por aí. Então vai ter bastante nível aí. Vai ter dummy scroll aqui. Vai ter bastante coisa. There will be, on lá, on English, there will be three giveaways from my stream and also giveaways from supported streams, like Mia, and Nitro Minds, and other streamers, like Sunchin, also from, from Poland, and other streamers that will come to the event. And we train the event for people so they can like reach the most people possible. People from Poland, people from US, people from Australia, people from everywhere. They can see the event. They also gonna make giveaways on the streams. Uh, and I will do be doing three giveaways. One giveaway was already revealed. This the second giveaway was also revealed, and now it's about to reveal the third giveaway. Are you guys ready? Oh, you're going to do it now. Oh, great. I had, had no clue it's going to be now. Perfect. So uh, would you like to first, because I, I like that game that you, you started, right? Uh, before you review, would you like to give a couple tips uh, just so people try to figure it out what it is? Okay. Uh, Art said is a really desirable item on the game. É um item que muita gente quer. Alguém consegue adivinhar? Can anyone guess? Can anyone guess what, which item will be? So it's On the item, third giveaway? An item that everyone wants. Everyone wants. I would say most of people want. Yeah. If you don't want, you can if you, if you don't want and win, you can give me back. You know? Yeah. It's okay, no problem about it. Is it a dong? Don't the hammer. Don't like no, the hammer just for it. Thunder Hammer já foi. Thunder Hammer vai ser a segunda. Okay. Thunder Hammer is the second giveaway was already revealed. But the third giveaway, that was the sick that I was going to reveal now. Golden Boots. Golden Boots? No. No? Golden Boots, no, not many people want it. Mages don't have, like, what we're going to do with the Golden Boots? So, yeah. Mage. Uh... Miss, Mr. Box. Malakai Go. Yeah. Some of my friend knows. Okay, a guy got it right on the on the channel on the oh, stream. So let's reveal it. Is it a child scroll? That's that's the third giveaway. A child outfit scroll. Oh, that's that's the cool. third giveaway. 
All right. Child outfits great scroll. Oh, you don't have it. You're faking it. Let me give you one second so I can grab it. And then I'm gonna show you. It's on one of the rooms that's the card that I didn't didn't show yet. Wow. Child scroll. How much is that worth, by the way? Nowadays. Like well, it's an, it's another item that you can't put price on. Yeah. Like the last time I heard, last time I heard, a guy paid over 10k MC for this scroll. 10K. That's the last time I heard it. 10k and that's insane yeah. that is okay. 600 euro okay here wow. see let's see if he has it see? uh oh wow and the floor that's too that's quite brave uh do does dillahan the character dillahan already has the the child outfit i suppose oh shit! i went down by mistake one second uh uh no i don't have it no i you don't have it okay now, I'm, it's an outfit, I like it, but it's not like my favorite outfit. Like, by yeah. far, my favorite outfit is the cultist, cultist outfit. Like, it took me a long time. I've had to farm it. Like, this outfit here. Wait. This, by far, is the is the most cool outfit, yeah. I think. You prefer that one than the... Yeah, over child. No. Yeah. What, what about the tutor outfits? Because that's... Uh, I never had it. Like, yeah, of course. But like... it, everyone when i'm playing dynasty and whatever server i'm on like everyone says wow what is that outfit like i want and because like the tutor outfit it's pretty amazing uh Saffron yeah. did a really good job there but of course it's yeah. not not obtainable uh yeah, you're like, a tutor. yeah yeah i i really enjoy mine like the the coolest of uh, the coolest is really cool also this mining card i first i think was like kind of silly but now, like now that I have is like is really cool that you have like a card that you can go on, like you can make like runs, races with people. It's really cool. Like I really enjoyed this this outfit here. It was like a really good job from Stefan as well. Yeah. So now I'm kinda on this outfit here. Just hope more people can get it so we can bet some races. Mm -hmm. Like I even post on the this on Discord the the they like I, I yeah. no 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 me uh, uh I I bet in races with like two others with the, with oh, the races. Okay, okay, yeah. Races. Yeah, so it was really like really cool as well. But let's hope more people can grab it. All right. Child of that. Okay. I mean child throw, perfect. That sounds, sounds like, like a great giveaway. giveaway. And you're doing now is it gonna be now or in some time the, the premium scroll? Wow. Uh, ah the premium scroll gonna be now. Actually oh. let me let me just do it now, one second. Yeah, if you're doing now, I'm gonna. Todo the mundo preparado, everybody yeah. ready? Uh, Are you participating as well? Okay. I mean, I have to, right? Uh, <laughs> yeah. Hopefully, <laughs> hopefully, I win after. Uh, I guys, uh, whoever's here on Discord, uh, on Medivia Meetups Discord, uh, go to Dullahan stream once more if you want. Of course, uh, you can get a premium scroll for free just by entering um, tickets. And uh, he's gonna do in the next five, like two minutes or something. Yeah, he's about to do it. So, just, uh, just have, to, just give him like two minutes. I have to pee, bro. That's yeah, no, how you no, no, no. Let me bribe back. One Take second. your time. Take your time. Oh, uh, see, there is a oh, well, there is a guy here. I didn't see him. There is a guy here with another, with the, with the oh, cart the, as well. The cart, yeah. And he can like bet some races. You know, it's cool life. Yeah. Oh, one. Hey, one, two, three. All right. Okay, they You can bet like some races. It's really cool. Like when you go around and bet races, we are like bet betting races around Ashen. So it was really cool when more people has it. So yeah. I just hope like people get it more often, you know? Yeah. It's, it's a very so nice outfit, I'm, yeah. Yeah, I'm kind of in love with the, the, the minecart outfit. Okay, let me okay, let me let yeah. me do and I'll be right back. Go there like, and then we're gonna stream the ends. Chief has a voice of a back end software developer. Interesting comments, John Bala. 
Very interesting. What do you mean though? Like a backend developer? Why not a front end? Like, I have no clue what that. Front end is not a developer. Oh, shots fired. Just meme. Interesting. I'll add that, I'll add that to the JavaScript folks. Is that front end? I think it is, right? I don't, I don't do any of that stuff. I, I just do the ABAP language, which is for uh, systems, uh, very legacy systems for uh, ERPs, you know, pretty cool stuff. So it's, it's kind of like COBOL. Uh, son saiu Dullahan. No, not really. Dullahan went for a P, so he should be back in a sec. And then he's going to do the giveaway. Meanwhile, apparently I'm uh, entertaining his 68 followers. So it's a great time for uh, the 68 followers of Dullahan to, if you guys want, of course, watch the... Okay, I'm back. Watch the content that I created okay, for Medivia, back. tutorials and everything. So just leave that sub there, help helps the channel it's free unlike the twitch subs anyway it's there i was entertaining your folks everybody listen to me yeah no we can hear you okay okay it's time for the for the all right giveaway here we go let's roll it let me check it okay everybody ready yes we are Todo preparado Close entries. Pick a winner. Pick a winner. Oh, Mr. Mr. Again? Bomba. No. Again, man. No, no, no. no. Can't this. That is not allowed. Yeah, he won again, they man. What the fuck? <laughs> yeah. No, he's not. I just want to reply or not. Oh, he's oh, he shit. stayed here. Oh. He stayed here. Jesus, he got it again. Oh, my. Think of the bright side. He is spending all his luck on the crane scroll. True. Maybe, maybe on the child outfit scroll. You know, it's not gonna be there. The luck when he needs it. Yeah. If he wants, of course, the child outfit scroll. Oh, if it is the wrong. Yeah. All right, folks. I'm gonna stop the video for now. Thanks for everyone that joined. I'm gonna stop the stage as well on Discord. I appreciate the time, Dylan. I'll see you guys around, and thanks again for joining. And I guess I'll see you guys okay. in the next one. Bye-bye. See ya. Thank Have you a guys. great day.